All right, so that last test was seriously disappointing. Apparently, being civil isn't motivating you, so let's, well, let's try her way, all right? Fatty, adopted fatty, 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 no parents. What? What exactly is wrong with being adopted? What, what's wrong with being adopted? Uh, uh, well, um, lack of parents. For the record, you are adopted and that's terrible. And also, with me. nothing. But so, well, some of my best friends actually are orphans. Also, but look at her, you moron. She's not fat. I am not a moron. Just do the test. Just do the test. Why can't you solve a simple test? I might have pushed that moron thing a little too far this time. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I hope that, didn't, hope that didn't disturb you too much then. It was the sound of books. Pages being turned. So that's just what I was doing. Just reading, uh, books. So not a moral. Anyway, just finish the last one. Just now the hardest one. Machiavelli. Do not know what all the fuss was about. Understood it perfectly. Have you read that one? Yes. Yeah, doubt it. Well, on with the test. Wish there was more books. Well, there's not. I was being a little bit facetious about that, wanting to get rid of monitors thing. They are actually really quite useful, so I do want them around. So, um, if you could just avoid smashing them. Oh, what, what was that? That was nothing! That was nothing! The body he's squatting in, my body, has a built-in euphoric response to testing. Eventually, you build up a resistance to it. It can get a little unbearable, unless you have the mental capacity to push past it. me just moving the old test chamber a little bit closer to me um out of thought maybe proximity to the test solving might give us stronger results what was that nothing, nothing. oh sorry i could have sworn you said something yes all right okay this is getting tiresome um, I'm, I'm surprised you haven't got something better to do, to be honest. Um, I know I have, but, um, you, what have you done? You've proven that you can break screens. It's proven. Well done. Factual. Well done. Good. Aren't you, little Miss Clever? Little Miss Smashy Smash?
Are you are you absolutely sure you're solving these correctly? I mean, yes, you solved it, but I'm wondering if maybe there's a number of ways to solve them, and you're picking all the worst ways. No, no, that was the solution. Ah, what am I missing? I'm going to tape you solving these, and then watch ten at once. Get a more sort of concentrated burst of science. Oh, on a related note, I am going to need you to solve these ten times as fast. Anyway, uh, just give me a wave, would you, before you solve this one, alright? I don't want to spoil the ending for when I watch it later. You solved it, didn't you? I, I told you to tell to tell me. Ah, why are you making this so hard for me? Remember when I told you that he was specifically designed to make bad decisions? Because I think he's decided not to maintain any of the crucial functions required to keep this facility from exploding. self-destructing, already fixed. Programmed in one last tremor for old time's sake. Two, like one or two more tremors in there, just for fun. Morning. Core overheating. I let him keep his job. I'm not a monster. Ignore what he's saying, but just keep on testing.
Sorry, does it actually make you feel good doing that? Because, you know, it's not impressive. No one's impressed. It's just glass, isn't it? Fragile. Anyone could... A baby could smash one of them. It's not impressive. Still nothing, let's keep moving. Sorry about the lift, it's out of service. Because it's melting. Might as well, you know, give you the tour. Um, to your left, you'll see some lights of some kind. Don't know what they do. Um, look very science here. And to your right, something huge hurtling to walk. Oh god, run! I'm not supposed to be here! Are you alright back there? Here, I'll turn the beam off. Wait, 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 wait! Oh no, 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 that's not helpful! That I... Ah! I don't know why I thought that would help. After seeing what he's done to my facility, after we take over again, is it all right if I kill him? Oh, you're alive! Great! Yeah, just uh, getting a, a test ready for you, obviously. Who else would I be doing it for? No one. So, let's see here. Exit, exit, exit. There is no exit. Not a problem, I'll just, I'll make an exit for your test. You told me to turn that beam off. I thought I had lost you. We're poking around for other test subjects. No luck there. Everyone's still dead. But, oh, I did find something though. Reminds me. I've got a big surprise for you two. Seriously, look forward to it. You know what? There are test subjects in Africa who don't even have monitors in their test chambers, all right? What do you think about that before you break any more of them, yeah? You two are going to love this big surprise. In fact, you might say you're going to love it to death. You're going to love it until, you, until it kills you, until you're dead. <laughs> All right, I don't know whether you're, uh, you're picking up on what I'm saying there, yes. but... Alright, he's not even trying to be subtle anymore. 
or maybe he still is, in which case, wow, that's kind of sad. Sorry, sorry, my fault. Bunch of fingers. Either way, I get the impression he's about to kill us. Carry on. Only three more chambers to your big surprise. <laughs> You solved it? Good. Good one. Good for you. So, he's inexplicably happy all of a sudden, even though he should be going out of his mind with test withdrawal. And he's got a surprise for us. What did he find back there? I'll bet you're both dying to know what your big surprise is. Well, only two more chambers. We're running out of time. I think I can break us out of here in the next chamber. Just play along. Surprise! We're doing it now. Okay. Credit where it's due. For a little idiot built specifically to come up with stupid, unworkable plans, that was a pretty well-laid trap. You probably figured it out by now, but I don't need you anymore. I found two little robots back here, built specifically for testing. Oh no. He found the cooperative testing initiative. It's something I came up with to phase out human testing just before you escaped. It wasn't anything personal, just, you know, you did kill me. There's fair. Ah! Well, this is the part where he kills us. Hello! This is the part where I kill you! Had a bit of a brainwave. There I was, smashing some steel plates together, and I thought to myself, yeah, it's... No, 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 don't do that. Don't... Stand right here, stand. Where do you go? Come back, come back! No, seriously, do come back, please. Come back, please. Okay, look, I've decided I'm not gonna kill you, okay, if you come back. Oh, just thinking back to the old times, the old days when we were friends, good old friends, not enemies, and I would say something like, come back, and he'd be like, yeah, no problem, and he'd come back. What happened to those days? Can't help but notice that you're not coming back, which is disappointing. Oh, I've got an idea! Yes, yes, in your face, I got armor! <laughs> 